Hey everyone, it's Janelle again, and I am here to talk to you today about Sea Fire by Natalie Parker. So Sea Fire is the story of Caledonia Styx, who is the captain of her own ship with an all-girl crew. Now the story is set in this post-apocalyptic fantasy world in which um, almost all of the world's land is gone. And what little is left is completely unlivable. Uh, so people either live right on the coast or they live on the sea itself uh, in ships. But the seas are controlled by the warlord Eric Athair, uh, who steals away young men to build his bullet army, which is why Caledonia's ship is all girls, because really there are no boys because they're being kidnapped. <laughs> um, and uh, Caledonia has real reason to hate Eric because her family was killed by his bullets when she was young. Now, when the story starts off, uh, when this attack on a bullet ship goes wrong, a bullet actually defects and saves her best friend's life. But she's still wary of this, of this young man until he tells her that her brother actually was not killed all those years ago, and he is actually alive, but is a bullet. So what uh, starts out as a you know, a rescue mission to save her brother from Eric's clutches uh, eventually grows into this revolution to save the seas um, from Eric's tyranny. Now, this is a story with a lot of action in it, a lot of high seas battles. If you like, you know, kind of pirate stories, this, this will be a good one for you. But in all, fair warning, it can, it's a little bit slower paced because the author takes the time to let you get to know the characters and their motivations. Um, and the world building is very detailed, which as a fantasy nerd, I loved. Um, others might, might find it a little slow, but you know, there are so many twists and turns in this story. And what starts out as this very simple uh, rescue mission become really becomes something greater and, you know, and kind of encompasses the uh, entire world and just ah it just becomes such a big story and I don't want to spoil anything so I won't I won't say anything further um, but if you're a bit of a patient reader and you're someone who cares about characters then you're sure to love Seafire and the rest of hold on I gotta reach off screen because there's more the rest of the trilogy